Hello, Renee Matt here. Um, I am opening the Lange Hair Training Essentials Kit. Um, this is by Jasmine Ray. If you do not know her, she has gorgeous hair. Um, and I love all of her tips and tricks to get your hair healthier and longer. My hair has grown so much in the last several months following things that she has taught. Um, so I just, she just released this and so I'm just checking it out. I washed my hair last night and um, it's super hot here. So it's getting pretty oily, pretty fast. I watched um, a training that she had just kind of going over what each one was. And number one was for the days where you're starting to look a little shiny. Um, so that's what I'm gonna use today. And then the second one is after a few days once you once you have gone a couple of days and you need, you're a little bit greasier and you need a heavier dry shampoo to get you through a couple more days. And then also you have the Make It Soft, which is a like leave-in conditioner, but it's like a spray conditioner. So I'm excited to try them. The whole point of waiting longer between washes is so that you, your hair can um, kind of rejuvenate itself it grows longer, it is healthier, it doesn't break as much. So it just keeps your natural oils. So you can do like a boar bristle brush and brush it through. And I'm gonna be doing my makeup in another video. So I do not have my makeup done yet. And it is roasting in here. So I might actually, I don't know if the fan, I have a fan right next to me. I don't know if the fan's gonna be too much right there. Um, but I plugged in, I have all these cords going on. I plugged in my irons, so I'm using the Lange Le Duo. And then I also have the Volume, which is amazing for volume. So I'm just brushing this through and I'm brushing the oils away from my scalp. face. Maybe I can figure out how to, maybe like that. Make it a mess. Okay. So let's see. Shake well. I think it's like a normal dry shampoo. So you shake it up. Now dry shampoos are one of those things where I didn't think I liked aerosol dry shampoos at all because they were all like super chemical smelling and I could hardly breathe when I sprayed it. That was only the first couple of ones that I used that I absolutely hated. <laughs> um, I did not like those. And, um, but I found some of the Lange ones that I do really like. There's, um, I have this Kenra one that is volume dry shampoo. I do really like this one as well. Um, and then there's another one, I can't remember the name of it. It's like a short little bottle. Um, and I really liked that one too, but it, that one's harder to find. So, okay, so let's see. You're supposed to do, ooh, it smells good. <laughs> so, okay, I'm getting distracted here. So you're supposed to put it through. the dog this morning. It is so hot here. We have, well, I don't know why I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt. That's probably stupid. We have the air on, but it's hot up here. Um, it's nice and cool downstairs. All right. But I walked outside to walk the dog this morning and I didn't even get, I don't think I even got 30 feet from the house and I was already sweating and I was like, ugh, it's gross. All right, maybe I can do this. Maybe I can turn this on low. 
and have it blowing on me. So you still get some breeze, but it's not so much. All right, so then what you do with dry shampoo is you just work it in. Oh, hope everybody is having a wonderful summer. It's going by so fast. Every summer goes by fast. I remember when I was growing up, everybody always said, the older you get, the faster time goes by. And it's so true. It feels nice. It's, um, I mean, you have like the dry shampoo feel, but it's not sticky or heavy. It's just like, it almost feels like a light powder on your hands, which I suppose is probably similar to what it is. All right, so then just brush that through now. feels nice. So I have these baby hairs that always curl and it always looks funky and typically I straighten them. I went many 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 years with straightening them every single day, sometimes multiple times a day, and um, they just fry and they never grow. So it's very rare when I straighten them now. I'm trying to stay away from heat on them that's one of the reasons I wanted to do the hair training was to use less heat on my hair so that it wouldn't fry and break off as much. All right, so then I'm going to take part of it up and I already put a heat protectant in it last night after my shower. So we're good there. And then I have another brush here that is more of a bristle brush. And all I'm going to do, oh, it would help if I turned the iron on. Th thankfully, this is a really fast one. So you just do the um, power button and then you click it until it's up to the top, the top that you want and you'll hear it kick on. So like I said, this is the LaDuo from Lunge. And I don't have a promo code or anything. I just love launch products. Um, but you can, if you go to the, the link in my bio has a shop my favorites section and some of my favorite products of theirs are in there. And I think it might be linked to my referral code, which is not an affiliate link. Um, but you could do my referral code if you wanted to. Um, otherwise they have a ton of promo codes on their website directly. So if you buy anything from them, look up their promo codes cause you can get a deal on um, their products. Not a little bit. Oops. It did take me a little while and I still struggle with it sometimes, but it did take me a little while to figure out how to use this. So if you're struggling with it in the beginning, you're not alone. Don't worry about it. And it, since it's, it's plates inside, um, since it has plates, you could just use it as a straightener. So it's really nice to have it for like traveling if you want to have the option of curling your hair or straightening your hair without bringing multiple irons. So I'm just gonna keep going all the way around. And we'll loop back at the top.
Okay, so we're up to the front, and so I just have this section in the front. So you kind of want to see where you're parting it, and I'm going to take it where I have a little bit on this side. I never do a straight part. It drives my little sister nuts, but I always think it looks weird with a straight part, so I never do it, and I never really do a, a zigzag either. I just do it where it falls. Um, so I'm going to take this section, and I... I am going to take this little piece up here. I already straightened them a little bit, but I'm gonna go straighten, and then I'm going to curl it out. Because that will help where it flows a little bit better. And then the curl is gonna be, It's this is a very soft, flowy curl. It's not like a tight curl at all. So then up here, I'm gonna take this, And after you curl it, while it's still warm, if you twist it the way that you curled it, it'll help it set in that curl a little bit better. And then you can also take the ends if you want to straighten them a little bit more. Because this is a straightener also, you can straighten those ends if they're a little bit too curly for you. I'm actually going to pull it the opposite direction, close to my head. And then I'm going to curl it towards my face. And then I'll swoop it over. Okay, so I'm gonna let that cool before we finish styling. Goodness gracious, it is toasty. Okay. And then, what do I want? Don't look at my cheap hairspray. I am using Aussie right now. Because I don't use hairspray very often. So I'm just going to let those set. I can turn this back towards me. turn this off I guess you just hold the power button and then it will shut off um, one thing to note if you get this is so it's very easy to push the power button accidentally um, so my hair wasn't curling as well at one point and it's because I accidentally lowered the setting which my hair does not curl well at so I had to jack it up a little bit again so once these are cooled you can rake your fingers through and break them up just to get that loose curl, or more of a wave, I guess. And then, make sure this is on, so I have my volume on. That also heats up super fast. I love tools that heat up really fast because sometimes I forget to turn them on. And then I don't wanna wait forever. I remember growing up, we had to like turn the curling iron on like 20 minutes before, I feel like. <laughs> like you had to make sure you were ready to curl your hair by the time you like, or that you gave it enough time because when you were ready to curl your hair, it wouldn't be heated up in time. So like this is like super speedy. Like you can just see it going up on its own. Well, obviously it's on its own. Goodness gracious, I can't talk today. So I'm going to separate this. So the balloon is like this waffle iron and um, I'm just going to take this top section. I'm going to clip that out. And I'm going to take this section. I'm just going to kind of stamp it in there. So you just stamp, stamp, stamp. And that's it. Pull it over. Get all these little baby hairs that go all over the place. I don't think there's an easier way to get volume unless you have a pile of hair that has its own volume. <laughs> like I was an avid backcomber. 
I don't ever back comb my hair anymore since using this. It's awesome. And this stays a lot better than back combing. Like I used to have to spray a ton of hairspray, back comb it like crazy. I'll leave that for a second. I'll go to this side. So you don't want to volume the very top portion because then you'll probably end up with those little stamped pieces, which aren't super noticeable unless you overdo it. All right, so that's it. The best products ever. And my hair feels so much healthier. It has grown so much faster. So I'm just gonna finish it off with a little bit of the Satin Nectar Nourishing Gloss. I seriously like, so many of my products are laundry products. It's, Kind of insane. Basically my entire beauty routine is Lange, Saint, and Lemongrass. That is pretty much all of my beauty stuff. There we go. So I could also, if you wanted to finish it off, I already used the Aussie, <laughs> the cheap stuff. Um, but if you wanted a healthier hairspray, this stuff is awesome and it gives a really nice glossy shine to it. Um, so that's really nice too. And that's a lemongrass flaxseed hairspray. So that's it. So that's the Lange Le Duo, the volume for the volume. And this will stay like volume, voluminous. Um, and if you wanted to do a little bit more dry shampoo, um, to help get some more like grit or some oomph in there. Um, you could do that also, but otherwise you can just kind of, you can brush through this. That's the thing I like about the volume is it's almost like the more you work with it, the, the more it separates or like your strands separate where that texture is and it gets fuller. So um, when you do it, you can brush through it. You can run your hands through it. There's no way I could have done that with back combing alone but you can do that with this, um, with this tool. So that is it. Now I'll go do my makeup, um, but thanks for watching. These I will have linked in the link in my bio if you guys want to see and check them out yourself. Um, and then obviously I had mentioned Saint. I am a Saint artist, so you can follow me for more, um, for videos, for tutorials on Saint makeup. Um, otherwise, just follow me for some fun beauty tutorials. So thanks for watching and I will see you next time.